What are you planning to eat for your next meal? How about an asteroid with a glass of juice? I know that sounds hilarious, bizarre, and you are possibly wondering why I would even suggest such a thing. Well, as it turns out, asteroids can be transformed into food for astronauts on deep space missions. Let that sink in. As per a new study published in the International Journal of Astrobiology, astronauts could use asteroids to meet their nutritional needs. I know you, you might still be wondering why asteroids? They are made of rocks after all. Well, let me break this down for you. Basically, the astronauts will not be consuming rocks directly. Of course, no one can be expected to eat rocks. Let me tell you what this involves. This is basically about extracting the carbon from space rocks and then turning it into something edible that can be consumed. As we know, there is only so much dried food that astronauts can carry. There are limitations, of course, and the idea is to tackle this challenge. The study was led by researchers from Michigan Technological University. Do you know about a U.S. Department of Defense project that turned plastic waste into edible food? Yes, that happened. Basically, the process involves breaking down plastic into solids, gas and oil. And the oil is then fed to bacteria. This happens with the help of a bioreactor and then results in the production of nutritious biomass. And I'll tell you why this is all the more interesting. As we all know, Sunita Williams and Bush Wilbore have been stranded in space. In fact, earlier, a cargo spacecraft arrived at the International Space Station to deliver food, fuel, other supplies for those on board. Remember, the ISS currently houses the expedition 71 crew and Bush Wilmore and Sunita Williams. They are stuck on the station due to safety concerns over the Boeing Starliner capsule that was meant to take them home. So that is how food and other items were supplied, in case you were wondering how that really happens. Also, Sunita Williams and Butch Wilmore have been stranded in space. Remember, they were meant to return in days, but the stay has gotten extended and how. So obviously, that warrants supply of food. Coming back to how asteroids could help meet astronauts' nutritional requirements, it is still a long way off. There is a major hurdle. Extensive toxicity testing is required, basically so that the biomass created for astronauts is safe to eat. But the fact that asteroids can serve as food is a possibility in itself means a lot. To stay up to speed with the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.